Hi there, folks, this is Max from Galaxy, um, RootGalaxyNote.com. Um, so today we're going to learn how to back up, install, um, and restore ROMs. And uh, a lot of you have seen my previous videos with other phones. For those of you new to Galaxy Note, um, this, you'll find this video very helpful. So I assume you've rooted your Galaxy Note, and also you've installed Clockwork Mod Recovery. If you don't know how to do those, go to my site, RootGalaxy. Um, no, note dot, rootgalaxynote.com I have all the instructions there and once you've got it rooted and installed Clockwork Mod Recovery um, you can launch Clockwork Mod Recovery um, you can use the CWM app if you don't have it like I don't here uh, let's let's launch it into uh, Clockwork Mod Recovery so I'm gonna turn it off or actually I can just reboot it into it but I'll show you how to do it um, using the ma the the manual manual method um, basically you turn it off and hold down the volume up and the center button and then hold down the power button All right. and then let go when you see the Samsung Galaxy Note GTN 7000 splash screen and this should get you into Clockwork Mod recovery there we go and let me adjust my camera real quick Next, what we're gonna do is uh, we're gonna go to backup and restore. Um, and anytime you want to back up your current ROM, this backs up all your settings, apps, um, everything except to, for the contents in your internal storage. So backup and restore. Hit the power button, and then hit uh, backup. Hit the power button, right? And this will back up your current ROM. I'm actually running a CM9 ICS ROM, so I'm backing that up. Um, but I backed up my stock ROM before I installed the CM9. So the first thing after you root and after you install recovery is you want to back up your rooted stock ROM. Just in case something goes wrong, you can always restore using um, Clockwork Mod Recovery. CWM stands for Clockwork Mod Recovery. Um, this completely backs up your whole system, so it, it's like you know, it's like having a whole backup of your Windows system with all your programs, or your Mac OS X Lion with all your programs. Um, but you know, the contents on your phone usually not that much, so you can save it. Um, it usually ends up being under uh, about a gig, maybe like five, six hundred megabytes. Um, so it's not too bad, and you can always move over your backed up folder to your hard disk um, to free up space on your phone um, so you have many choices anyway it's backing up and I will be back when this is done and I'll show you how you can switch between ROMs um, I will go and restore my stock ROM that I backed up um, yesterday and you can also switch back to this ROM you know back and forth all right see you later I'll be back uh, folks so it is done um, so anytime you want to restore um, that's how you back up ROM what you do um, is back up all to try different ROMs um, and back up everything so I'm gonna restore to my stock ROM and you can also go rename these folders um, it's in the your internal storage and it's under clockwork mod um, and slash backup directory where you can go and change the name. See, I've changed my. Um, it also timestamps when I saved it, which is January 2nd, 2012. And I added stock for stock ROM. And the one I just uh, backed up is the CM9. Um, so I'm going to restore my stock ROM just to show you. And this will restore my whole ROM um, before I installed my CM9. So it's um, restoring it's checking MD5 sums and it will restore it'll take about like five minutes so I'll be back when this is done hi folks the restore is complete and we can reboot system now and let's see uh, if we got my original stock rooted ROM back um, you'll see the splash screen change from um, what was the ICS ice cream sandwich to the normal Galaxy Note um, so that's the normal Galaxy Note. And it should boot up shortly. Um, so this is how you can use Clockwork Mod Recovery to back up and
and restore ROMs. And it's just not for backing up, but it's also a, bit, uh, a way of switching between ROMs easy on the go. Um, I can do this on the bus or on the plane, anywhere. And as you can see, I've restored my ROM within a matter of maybe like 10 minutes, 5 minutes, 10 minutes. Anyway, that's how you use Clockwork Mod Recovery. Um, and you can also see all my apps are uh, restored. Um, just the way it was before I installed the the, um, the CM9 ICS ROM. Anyway, I'll sh uh, have more cool videos. Uh, don't forget to check out rootgalaxynote.com. Alright, for more. Subscribe. See y'all later. Thanks. Bye-bye.